happy Friday. Oh, happy Friday to you. <laughs> you got the giggles. I love it. <laughs> because you know what? Everywhere you look, it doesn't make a difference. TV, right. magazines, people are always looking for ways to feel and look better. So it is no surprise that medical aesthetics is a booming 10 billion dollar field. Wow, and it's actually the perfect time to be a part of it and help others feel good about themselves. Lewis Silberman is here to tell us about this great job opportunity. We have Lewis the laser guy back with us today. <laughs> Hello ladies, how you doing? It's great to have you back. Nice We're doing well. Awesome. So, okay, I want to know what kind of person does it take to be a cosmetic laser technician? Great question. And a lot of people don't even know what a cosmetic laser technician is, but as you mentioned, it's a 10 billion dollar industry. So when people say medical aesthetics, sometimes they think of plastic surgery or dermatology. Medical aesthetics is every type of cosmetic technology for anti-aging like laser hair removal, photofacial skin rejuvenation, laser touch removal, body contouring and more. So there was over 10 billion dollars of services performed nationwide in places like med spas and doctor's offices and gyms. And people don't know that you don't have to be a doctor, you don't have to be a nurse, you don't have to be an esthetician to become a cosmetic laser tech. You just need a two-week training course. You have to have a passion for health and beauty, and you can become one of those cosmetic laser techs out there in the working world, working for the med spa, working for the doctor's office. It's amazing. It's awesome. You know, I, I do think that is true. People think you have to have already had this big background or something, but that's where you guys kind of step in and, and, and help with that. Yeah, we've been doing this for 10 years, and what's interesting is that we've got people that, yes, we train doctors and nurses how to do Botox injections and dermal fillers and cosmetic lasers. And yes, we train estheticians and cosmetologists who are doing facials and peels to advance their career and use technologies. But we train countless career changers, people that were stay-at-home moms. They were real estate agents. They worked at a department store. And, and they just wanted to change. They wanted to do something new and exciting and fulfilling. And they heard about the beauty industry and they heard they could be an aesthetic laser technician and work at a doctor's office at the med spa after only a two week program. They go, gosh, is this real? Only two weeks and they get out there and do this? Well, yes. After a two week program, they can really get out there and just change their world. It's, wow. it's amazing. Wow. So you've listed a bunch of occupations that people can have after uh -huh. graduating the institute. Right. So let's really dive into what the, the learning <laughs> procedure is like. What are the procedures that they're going to be learning in that two weeks? Okay. A great question. So we have two segments of our population out there. We've got the person that wants to be a cosmetic laser technician, and they're doing services like laser hair removal for permanent hair reduction, photofacial skin rejuvenation for age spots, sun damage, broken capillaries, hyperpigmentation, and even skin tone rosacea. They're doing laser tattoo removal. They're making tattoos go away. They're doing non-surgical body contouring. They're, they're le letting people lose inches off, you know, basically off, you know, weight loss, cellulite, and fat reduction. They're doing vein reductions. They're doing all these technology treatments to make people look good and feel good. And those are what we call the laser techs. And they're complete career changers, and they're, co you know, estheticians, cosmetologists. And then there's the doctors and nurses that are doing the injections, the Botox, the dermal fillers. So there's a different class every single month in Scottsdale, Arizona for both those who want to be a laser tech and the doctors and nurses who want to advance their career and add to their practice. So it's a whole world of services out there. Have you ladies tried these things before? Or? Uh, you ready? Are you I'm kidding? kidding. <laughs> I was just born this way. <laughs> I was just born. You didn't switch. Like Beyonce woke up like this. So, okay. Uh, and whether it doesn't matter what you are, what field we're talking about, journalism, uh, laser tech, whatever it is, when you go and you learn a new trait, okay. the <laughs> scary part is going out into the real world and finding the job with this new yeah. thing that you found. Or, you know, you have all this knowledge, you're excited, right. you want to go do it. So you guys help them in going from, okay, I have this information, now I need to make some money doing it. Yeah, great question, because the biggest fear is always, okay, it's fun, it's exciting, yeah. the beauty is fun, it's exciting and changing people's wor worlds and it's a great customer, but you know, you know, am I gonna get a job? Where am I gonna work? Is there a market out there for this? But like I said, $10 billion was spent nationwide last year and this is gonna blow your mind. So when I got in this business 11 years ago, there was one medical spa in the United States. And I got excited about the idea. I said, wow, I'm gonna be the second one in the country getting this med spa business and doing training in med spa. And I built a med spa in Scottsdale, Arizona. It took me a year and a half to do it. I go to open my doors and there was over 90 open when I opened my doors nine years ago. Today, 2016, there's over 3,500 medical spas open nationwide. Wow. Out of the $10 billion that was spent last year, ladies, just shy of three billion was spent in those medical spas. The rest was spent in doctor's offices. But you're probably thinking, okay, doctor's office, skin business, plastic surgeons, derms, they were doing it 11 years ago, they're still doing it. But now you go to your primary care doctor, internal medicine, nurse practitioner, OBGYN, urgent care doctor, they're all doing cosmetic medicine. They're doing laser hair removal, they're doing photofacial skin rejuvenation, Botox fillers, 
A, because they love it, it's exciting, the results are good, but B, it's a cash business. And doctors are getting killed by insurance. My dad, for example, my dad's a neurologist, psychiatrist. He told me he billed $1,000 for a client that came in for some consulting services. He only collected $300 from the insurance company. He wasn't getting reimbursed. This is happening to doctors nationwide. So you have a flood of doctors adding this to their practice rather than getting a second job, and they're hiring these cosmetic laser techs. So out of the 10 billion that was spent, seven or eight billion dollars of that was spent in the doctor's offices nationwide. Now we've got publicly traded gyms. There's med spas at Lifetime Fitness and Equinox. And it, it's just, I promise you ladies, two to three years from today, you're gonna see med spas in CVS, Walgreens, Walmart, Target. It's just, it's booming, it's out of control. So and, this, is, this is huge. Yeah. And Lewis, it, I know a lot of people are, are interested, but they need to hear more. So you offer open houses. Yes, we have the most fun party. You ladies have to come. So it's in Scottsdale, <laughs> Arizona. It's not this Thursday, it's next Thursday. This is the party of all parties. There will be over 100 people there. We give amazing free food, free wine, catered party. We give out thousands and thousands of dollars of free prizes, but get this, the free prizes we're giving out, we're giving out thousands of dollars in free Botox, free dermal fillers, free laser hair removal, free photo facials, and training scholarships for people that are interested in getting this business. Training scholarships towards being a cosmetic laser tack or an injector at this party. It's called the Skin Scene. It's next Thursday, 7 p.m. They can go to our website, a National Laser Institute, and check it out with the Skin Scene. It's free. Come bring a friend. It's, it's amazing. It's a party. I it's love a party. it. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, it's a laser guy. We love it when you come and visit us. I'm going to give them the details on that open house awesome. one more time. But thank you again so much for coming. Thank you, ladies. Fun, fun. Absolutely. The National Laser Institute open house event will take place, like we said, February 4th at 7 p.m. The address is 16601 North 90th Street. That's out in Scottsdale, Arizona. You can call 1 800 914 4504 or visit nationallaserinstitute.com slash skin scene.